We are getting vital, as we do with Andrea Duplessis, our vital expert, tackling one of the most essential nutrients in all food groups, essential fatty acids. Um, and I'm picking up the smells of some of my craving foods here. Um, but of course, getting these kind of omegas into a child becomes a lot more difficult. I mean, you're not gonna shove uh, fish paste down your child's throat. Um, talk to us a little bit about the essential fatty acids and why it's so important that we need to have them in our, our diet. Well, fats are always a discussion point in diet. And if you look at optimum nutrition for children, um, it's so important to look at what children love eating and often it's the unhealthy fats. Yeah. Like if you look at potato chips for instance, biscuits, muffins, cakes, pastries, things like that, contain processed fats and not the essential omega-3s, what they need for brain development. Um, so it's really important to start by trying to reduce the intake of the unhealthy fats first to make place for the healthy fats. Give us a, a quick rundown on those healthy fats. What are the ones that we really do need to include? Critical for childhood and um, specifically for brain development and cognitive development, learning ability, reading ability, and that's all based on research, is omega-3 fatty acids. They've done so much research showing that children with learning difficulties and reading difficulties perform better if you supplement with omega-3 or if you optimize the dietary intake of omega-3 fatty acids. I was going to say they've had huge success with things like um, ADD mm. and those sorts of mental conditions that normally you know, you'd have to come in with medication which you want to avoid if you can. Well if you can and the, the fact is if you don't give your child enough of those omega-3 fatty acids while they're growing up they might have concentration problems because there's simply not enough of those essential nutrients built into their brain cells. One of the key components of our brain tissue is DHA, and that's one of the omega-3 fatty acids we get from fish specifically, and that's why we've got the sardines and um, fish paste there. On okay, tray. take us through what we've got on our little tray here. Well, if you had to look at a child and the optimum intake of omega-3 fatty acids on a daily basis for brain development, so the optimum intake, you would have to give them either this tin of sardines to eat, and some children love sardines and in the form of fish cakes, but others don't, you know? <laughs> so the other option you can try is fish based, but for that to get enough, they'll have to finish this whole spoon. Which means you're gonna be taking quite a lot of <clears throat> bread in with that as well, exactly. unless you're gonna just be spooning it straight And there's in, yeah. quite a bit of salt in there as well, so it might not be the, the best option. Okay. Um, and then also from plant food sources, you also get omega-3s in flax seeds, and these are these um, brown shiny seeds we get on seed loads and things like that. But to get enough, you have to eat you can't eat this bowl of flax seeds because it will uh, I'm not even going to challenge well, myself to do that. Great digestive discomfort, but it, it's showing if you want to get to optimum levels that it's actually difficult to do that through the diet, and that's where supplements come in. I'm just one of those people that gets very excited about supplements, you know, and my friends tease me about it. Um, when looking at branding and packaging for a child, always see you have to be a lot more creative, and this looks insanely creative. This is a brilliant way of kind of getting it past the kid without them even noticing it. Absolutely. I mean, I don't know if you've ever seen how difficult it is to give a child a fish oil capsule to swallow. <laughs> I don't even like... remember how difficult it was. My oh, mother yes. gave me one. Yeah. Right. So Vital came up with a fantastic product. It's the Kids Omega-3 Sherbet. So it's made from fish oil. Um, and it's... I'm give that a round yes. of applause because that's just brilliant. We've got the most amazing team of food technologists and chemists that came up with this formula. So it's Sherbet. It's made with fish and you are welcome to taste that. <laughs> I'm going to. I'm not going to lie and say I haven't tasted it already because I have, but check that. Like he just wants to taste it again, mm -hmm. I think, because he loves it. Mm -hmm. you know, the problem mm. is kids are going to be like sneaking these out of the cupboard and taking them to school. Well, that's the feedback we've been getting, <laughs> that, that the moms are hiding the, the sherbet packs because you, you take one a day, um, and that's the optimum dose for brain development, yes. Any optimal time during the day, when should children be supplementing getting their omegas in? With omegas, it doesn't matter. Okay. Any time of the day. So whichever time is convenient, these are nice to pop into the lunchbox. Mm. Or if you want to be sure that they take their one per day, um, then give it to them at home before they go to school. I want to watch you eat it. Uh, <laughs> okay, where can people get hold of you if they've got any questions or want to get into a few more of the details? Yes, um, I've, I've got so much information about omegas and how it helps with brain development and reading ability and all of that. So if people want to ask more questions, they can go to my Facebook page. And it's called Andrea Duplessis, Vital Experts. Andrea Duplessis, Vital Expert. Thank you so much. You truly are the expert. Um, I think my brain could do with a few more fatty acids in there. Um, but this really is how I've developed my own health using essential oils, fatty acids, these sorts of things. And it really has helped me so I can endorse this 100% even in the tiny tots. And this is something they're going to absolutely love. Thank you, Andrea.
I'm gonna steal one more. Put it all here, Chad. <laughs> Trust Vital for your family's health. 